Abby. I'm leaving tonight and I want you to come with me. <laughs> I love getting to work with my best friend Willow and to create something of my own that I could be passionate about and that I could work on. And just having the creativity to, to do that and to, to pursue that was just incredible. Um, I think my favorite part was definitely when we went to um, the cultural arts here. It was so fun, that hallway was so spooky and I haven't been there in a while and also working with Will and Elon was really fun too. Um, honestly, I think just how fun it was behind the scenes, just all of the little silly goofs. I really liked when we got to go, well, I liked the places that we got to film. I thought that was really cool. Like, get, like the filming like experience, like getting to do that for the first time. I really loved getting to make this film in one week. Um, it was a great challenge to put, put my organizational skills, my production skills to the test to make it happen so quickly. Um, and I love getting to work with so many great people. Abby. This is the producer here, so Elon, they are not making this my overtime Abby. well. My least favorite part was working with my best friend Willow, <laughs> which is also my favorite part. Because, you know, it means I, I couldn't do everything that I wanted to do, but it also means I think we created a better film out of that, which is, you know, my favorite and least favorite part. The most challenging part was that we only had one week to make the film. Um, which means we probably couldn't really do all the things that we wanted to um, and given the nature of the film and what we were submitting it for um, We had kind of a lot of hoops we had to jump through to stay qualified um, And I think that if we hadn't had those we could have made it a bit more exciting But I still think it's a great movie anyways I think like learning those lines in such a short amount of time was kind of tricky for me Especially with the re like the repetition of it. That was crazy. Ooh, um, probably figuring out the lighting in like the opening shots that took us a while and then our lights kind of died. Probably the learning the lines fast, but it's also like good practice because you know it's something you have to do a lot. So, one of my favorite scenes is the final one uh, with uh, with Tracy and Madison just yelling their hearts out. <laughs> My favorite scene is the uh, final chase scene with the two, with uh, Abby and Sarah getting chased by uh, the guard. Just so much action, so intense, and some great action. Great action, great acting from Tracy Bethea. My favorite scene, I think, is when I'm getting, like, literally dragged by Ryan and I'm screaming. I think that was so fun. I think probably when she opens the door. I really liked the, well, like, the end scene, like, go, running up the stairs when, like, um, Abby gets, like, taken and, like, the screaming. I thought that was fun to film. Oh, I fell. <laughs> oh, no. Abby. Ryan's pulling me. Abby. Ryan is pulling me. Okay, wait. Oh, okay, maybe not that good. <laughs> I really like Abby's character. I thought, like, it was really sweet, but it was sad at the end, but I liked her character a lot. Um, my favorite character would be Sarah. Uh, I definitely think uh, Sarah, uh, played by Madison Moss. My favorite character would obviously be Patient 16. Uh, sleeping Patient, obviously. Come on. I've been in films before. Oh my god! With this unique challenge, well, honestly, I think it was, it was the script for me. Writing the script was the hard part. The, the filming, it was just about scheduling, that was super easy, we, we shot there and there. Jacob pretty much handled all the paperwork, that was easy for me, for me at least. It was, it was the writing of the script, getting something that I was truly proud and willing to send to other people, and, th and I think we did a good job. When you do a film in a week, you have less time, so you're kind of restrained in what you're capable of doing. Um, and we couldn't do all of the great locations that I'd hoped we could have, um, and you know, get some more crazy props, um, but I think that kind of made us think even more creatively and outside the box, which I think ultimately helped us. <laughs> Definitely the speed, but um, uh, unique challenge from creating it in a week. I think finding the like proper spaces to film each sequence, we, I think we got pretty lucky with that. But I feel like that was definitely a challenge. Strings had to be pulled behind the scenes, and a lot of that. 
Um, definitely, like, for me personally, memorization, and I think, like, connecting to the character in such a short amount of time. A lot of, like, the pace with the learning. I would say that. That was, like, it was very, like, okay, so we're gonna film tomorrow, we gotta learn it now. That, and just, well, this doesn't really have to do with the week, but just, like, the running. <laughs> There's a lot of running. <laughs> Madison, how has how's your experience been on working on Patient 17? Literally the best workout of my life. Literally. <laughs> Literally, don't pay for cardio. Do this. <laughs> Can you go lower? Shawty got low. Shawty got low, low, low. Um. I can get really low with this mic. <laughs> get low, low. Like this isn't oh, Let's play a little game. Yeah. Okay. Is that good? Low notes. Literally, how? That was the best part. Let's play a little game. Talking about the actual like. Oh, I'm here at the um, level. Sarah running up the stairs. Martini shot. Okay. What do I do? Let's say we love you. Oh, what? I Where's so the boom cute. in the middle? Yeah, you got it. Can I say my lesbian lover? <laughs> oh, That's, That's a wrap on Tracy! That's a wrap!